here is a really beautiful red clover. Red clover is one of my favorite herbs for lymphatic health. You can tell that it's red clover, obviously first, because the flower is really pinky purple, but also when you look at the leaves, you see the little, see the little lighter colored arrow in the leaf? That will tell you for sure that you are looking at red clover. Red clover can really help your body get its lymph moving. And lymph is so important because it carries the trash out of your body. So as long as you are keeping up with all of the extra fluids and all of the extra trash, then your body will be a lot healthier. So red clover can be helpful for a lot of different situations that have sort of impaired lymphatic flow, whether that's rheumatoid arthritis or complications from diabetes, or even just if you've been eating a lot of sugar lately, or if you have compromised kidney health. These are all things that red clover can help because red clover improves lymphatic flow and all of those states have a lymphatic component to them. So uh, another aspect of red clover is that it is very high in mineral content. Now, we typically work just with the flowers. You might get a little bit of leaf in there, but really just the, the, the blossom here at the top is what we're really going for. And the mineral content in them is really fantastic. Now, when you are making a tea that is a high mineral tea, it's important to let it steep for a good long time, like four to eight hours, so that you really get all of the benefit out of it. So I like to set up my red clover long infusion right before I go to bed at night so that it is ready for me the next morning. I just put about an inch of red clover in the bottom of a mason jar, a quart sized mason jar, and then I pour in some boiling water. I let it sit overnight. And in the morning, I have a mineral rich, super nutritious, almost like a super vitamin, uh, but it's tea and I put it in my water bottle and drink it all day long. So why don't you try some red clover and see what you think?